I have any idea on the lifespan of Shepherd with DM? Well, it depends on how old. Oh, that's coming from Cindy. Um, it depends on how old your dog is when they get the DM. And usually DM occurs somewhere, anywhere from seven to eight. It can happen earlier than that. But um, anywhere from seven to eight, I think is about when it, it, it can start to show up. And it is something that's genetic. So it's nothing you can do to prevent it. Um, well, you know, and I say that, although it, with all these benefits from CDB oil, um, a lot of preventative things it's doing, maybe that's, maybe that's not going to be true. But I know for my case, when my dog had it, you know, there was something I could have done beforehand. Um, so the lifespan is just going to then depend on how rapidly the disease progresses. And um, I originally went to my Western vet who basically was going to send me home with like, you know, anti-inflammatories and pain meds and said, there's something we can do. And that just kind of wasn't acceptable to me. So I spent a lot of time doing research and that, that's when I ended up turning to um, acu acupuncture and herbs. And I, it, it did, it really did prolong his, his life and his quality of life. So I, I am a true believer of that. Um, and we went uh, an extended period where we didn't get treatment. Um, we had we had gone about a week extra, or maybe not even that long, just because of uh, conflict of uh, schedules. And it, it was um, very very visible um, how much he needed that acupuncture uh, session. So um, lifespan it, it's just going to again it's going to depend. You know, if you have a dog that contracts it at ten, well, you're already kind of knocking on the door. Um, uh, versus if you get a dog that's seven and eight, and then it's just going to depend on what kind of treatment therapy, uh, what the what the route is you take on that. So every every dog is different. It's hard to really tell you, uh, pinpoint it down. I don't want to get trapped into that. Um, okay, so Cindy, you're saying she was eight. She was eight when she contracted it. Cindy, she's, oh no, she's 10 and a half and she's still, she was eight when she contracted it and she was 10 and a half and still going. So that's a good sign. And as you know, my big thing is quality of life. You know, if she's still mobile, she's still able to get around. Now mobile, she's not going to be getting around like she was when she was six. Um, but right, she's still able to get up, take herself outside to, to go potty. Um, and the other big thing is appetite. As long as they have a, a strong desire for it to eat, they have their appetite, they have a will, they have a, you know, a reason. 